Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will see how we can easily run MinGW on our Windows 10 system, 64 bit. That means we will learn how to download and install and for running C and C++ programs. So let's see how. At first, we will download it. Go to your browser. We are using Chrome. You can use any browser. On Google type MinGW, press enter. On pressing enter, herein the downloader is visible. Click on it to open. The download button is visible. I'll click on it to download. So the download completed. I'll straight away double click on it to install. Let's minimize this. The setup started. I'll click on install. Herein keep all these options default. If you want to change the installation directory, you, you can change from here by clicking change. But uh, guys, I'll keep the same. Click on cancel. You can also keep same. So it will get installed under C drive mingw folder. If you want to remove the start menu and desktop, you can unselect them, but I'll keep the same and click on continue. Now the installer is downloading mingw. It will take some time. You need to you need to have a good internet connection for this. Now guys, you can see catalog update completed. Now you need to click on continue. Here it is installation database updated. Click on continue now. Now here it is the installation manager. Now we need to go for these packages by selecting them. This will download compilers for C, C++. I'll click on it. On clicking, it will give an option to mark for installation. I'll select this. Now go to the second one. Click on mark for installation. The third, I'll click the G++ one. Mark for installation. Let's click the second last one also. Now it looks fine. We have gone for the package C++ plus plus compiler and objective C compiler and the first two we also went for it okay after selecting all this click on installation and you need to just click on apply changes it's okay to proceed yes we are installing four packages click on apply now it will connect to the source and will download from the website it will take ample amount of time you need to have a very good connection for this So guys, now you can see we have successfully downloaded all the packages and installed it. It took a lot of time. So if it goes on, do not worry. It will take time based on internet connection. It took around five to seven minutes on my system. Click on close. So guys, we have downloaded everything. Now let's set the path. Minimize this. Let's go to the path wherein we installed it. Here it is guys go to C drive here in I hope you remember we installed in C drive therefore C drive mingw here it is go to bin and right click and copy this path after that let's go to start and set environment variables type environment variables here it is guys click on edit the system environment variables after clicking under system properties go to environment variables now under this the following is for only Amit user on this system and these are for all the users on this system to avoid any future errors go for system variables path double click on double clicking all the system paths are visible environment variables click on new and just right click and paste the same path the bin path here it is now click on OK. After that click on OK again and the last time click on OK. Now we have completed the installation and we have set the path. So let's verify the installation. Go to start. Type CMD. Click on it to open. After clicking guys type G++ hyphen hyphen version and press enter 
to verify that we have successfully installed or not press enter so guys now if the following is visible that means we have successfully installed minjw and gcc for c and c++ program so guys in this video we saw how we can easily download and install minjw if you like the video do subscribe to our channel number things